change. Free energy. So we will see the Hamel's free energy that is represented by the A. So for this uh, formation of Hamel's free energy, we will replace uh, variable that is entropy with is the corresponding properties that is the temperature. So once again here y is our u and x is what s and what e will be the m dy by dx. So we will use the uh, our reference equation for internal energy that is du is equal to Tds minus Pdv. Now, what do you want? Our properties uh, variable is entropy, which we will try to replace. So, here, here it is come dou y by uh, dou, uh, dou y by dou x is dou u by dou s, where volume and n constant. So, here I will divide both side by dou s and keeping volume constant. So, this term goes to 0 because volume is constant here and here volume is 0 and this term goes to 1. So, uh, dou u by dou s is volume constant is nothing but the t. So, here I can write t. So, our the property variable m is nothing but the t. Now, we will go to the actual equation y is equal to mx plus c and our transformation equation is y minus mx and we will put the variable. So, y is what? y is u and m is what? t and x is what? s. So, this comes and c is what? a. So, a is equal to u minus t s. Let us differentiate both sides. So, d a is equal to du minus t d s minus s d t. Once again we know that d u is equal to t d s minus p d v. So, we put it here. <coughs> t d s minus p d v minus t d s minus s d t. So, t d s t d s will be cancelled and the term depending is minus PDV minus HDT. Let us rearrange it. So, minus HDT minus PDV that is what is DA or we can see that A is a function of A is a function of T and V. T, V and if N is there then N. So, here we can see the same energy representation when, when I am changing this non measurable property because entropy we cannot measure directly. So, this entropy is measured in the form of temperature and when I change this property, so that energy is called the Gibbs uh, sorry Hammer's free energy. So, when we change this entropy in the form of temperature and that energy we measure is called the Hammer's free energy. So, this is the another application of Legendary transformation to determine the Hammer's free energy.